Hey folks, it's Jody with Strength and Wisdom Tarot, here to do another Strength and Wisdom Tarot adventure. Uh, Savannah Bryan sent me a clip, a small video on a pretty interesting house out in Oklahoma City. And I'm going to share that with you and then draw some cards on it. So, let's get some pretty interesting story to it. So, let me get this here. Yeah, you can see it. This is the Overholzer house, the Overholzer mansion in Oklahoma City. It's beautiful, and the legend is that somebody got murdered in this house, a family. Um, after that happened, nobody's really lived in it since. So it says the first great house in Heritage Hills was built in 1905 on the outskirts of Oklahoma City by Henry Overholzer. For many years, the Victorian mansion was Oklahoma City's showplace and social center. So, there it is. And I think it's beautiful. I, I wonder if the mystery is true. So, this is the Overholzer okay. house. Pretty interesting, huh? And the house is beautiful. Savannah, thank you so much for sending me the clip. Um, so, it was a family that supposedly, legend has it, um, was murdered there. And the house after that just kind of never had occupancy there. It was like a social um, house, meet and greet house. So, I'm going to use the steampunk tarot cards for this read. Let's see what happened if the legend is true. The Overholzer House, 1905. What happened in that house? I have a bunch of cards that came out, but it's too many. But I'll take a look at them anyway. You have the Queen of Wands. Fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or someone fire-like. They get the Page of Wands. This could be a child. The Knight of Pentacles. Could have to do with a Earth sign. We have somebody who has it all here. Happy house, happy spouse. Hmm. Interesting. Let's we'll see if those cards come back out. Holster house. What happened? What happened inside that house? Hmm. Now I have the page of pentacles here. And this is, you know, a messenger of material things. As well as loyalty, love, and all that. Somebody looking from a curtain, though. Somebody looking behind the scenes. Maybe watching a gathering, watching a... A social event? An onlooker? Hmm. We have the Eight of Pentacles here. That's somebody putting their nose to the grindstone, learning a skill, quality, a craft. Working on them to be them the best them they could be. It's almost like somebody's looking from behind a curtain while somebody is working. Hmm. And this person doesn't know that somebody's watching them. Hmm. Something's seen very clearly, though. Now we have the Eight of Swords in reverse. Blindfold off. Somebody sees something clearly now. Again, somebody watching somebody. Maybe they, they kept thinking about somebody, thinking about some, somebody, you know, because this would be trapped by thoughts. It's almost like I feel, someone's like, well, I'm just going to go see what that person's doing. And behind a curtain, they see that somebody is diligently working. What happened in that house with that family? Hmm. Okay. We have the ace. Of swords here. Cutting off the things that no longer serve you. 
a chance to either speak the truth, know the truth, or hear the truth. Communication. Somebody sees the truth. They, you know, if they thought that somebody was lying, and they go spying on them, following someone. Now we have the magician. Very powerful card. Can make anything happen. Hmm. Entertainment. Someone comes to entertain. It's funny. You have the Ace of Swords here. And the magician's holding a sword too. A sword on the wall. A mounted sword. What if it's that sword that actually was used? I almost feel like somebody gets invited there. Hmm. Ten of Wands. Somebody wearing the weight of the world on their shoulders. Right under the page of Pentacles of the person that's looking. It could be a younger person. Now, the overholster, I hope I'm saying that right, had a family. A family of five, I believe. This could be a daughter wondering what her dad's working on could be a wife a wife looking in this I feel it's younger somebody hears something and they go to see what it's what it is hmm The Empress, Queen of all Queens here, Libra Taurus energy, the mother, what was I just saying, the wife, right under the Eight of Pentacles, Three of Wands, hmm, I almost feel like, you know, something comes in, maybe it was foggy, not quite Someone's meeting somebody. Perhaps to bring him back. Maybe it's a guest. A guest. Okay. A guest at the house. Because, you know, Empress, she likes to entertain. As well as look good, you know, very accommodating. Great mom, great support unit. The great wife. I feel like this is someone that was invited there. Hmm. Husband could have worked a lot, or maybe he worked like somewhere in the house, like had his own office or something, diligently working. Now we get the Four of Cups in reverse. It's kind of what I'm feeling here. In the upright, this may be somebody, you know, daydreaming, fantasizing card. It's not what he has, you know, isn't good enough, but a fourth cup would be amazing. That fourth cup is up on the shelf. In reverse, this is like not fantasizing about it anymore. It's like actually bringing something into fruition. So it's kind of like, and here's the Ace of Swords. The Ace of Swords can be an epiphany, an aha moment. And that makes sense. Somebody fantasizing, you know, daydreaming about what they're going to do. And then they finally, you know, get out of the fantasizing thing and they actually do it. So anybody came over by ship or by boat, they might have had some sort of uh, presence 
about them, you know, some stature. But powerful. Oh, this got nothing to do with love. Ace of Cups in the reverse under the magician. I think somebody fulfilled <laughs> page of ones again. A message to take action. To put something in motion, to put something in action. And I'm looking at this empress like, you know, she looks very nice, dressed nice. She could be pregnant. But like as a gracious host, somebody's coming. Somebody's been working very hard on something, giving something their all. Could be the house, a project. I feel like somebody comes in and they're acting on this, bringing a fantasy into reality. This could have been a well, I don't know why I just heard Jack the Ripper, but somebody who had some, you know, some stature, some presidents, well renounced just came to my head. But I think this is the person that has the this fantasy. It's almost like, you know, poof, they appear. Somebody has reached success here. The three of wands. They took a course of action. They left by ship. They left by ship. Because the Three of Wands with success, it's like somebody boarding a ship in the night. And I think somebody witnessed this. I think one of the children saw, got curious, looking for something, and their eyes are wide open to what they see. And this prestigious person that was actually going to be a guest there or was a guest there somebody acted on a fantasy so when you get the page of wands taking a course of action then you get the Queen of Wands again, the wand to come out in the beginning, taking a course of action, a rider, coming to a beautiful home, beautiful family, fairy tale house, fairy tale life. And it was ended. Somebody saw the opportunity. And they acted upon it. It had nothing to do with love. It had nothing to do with greed. It had nothing to do with, you know, this person, person basically fulfilled a fantasy. I think they did think about this. Think about what they're going to do. And they did it. Now, maybe the mother and the father or one or the other was going to be the target, but somebody saw. And then... They had to be done in two. Wow. I'm going to clarify the magician. Why is the magician here? The navigator? Yeah. 
coming, you know, coming over there in the moon. Maybe it came unannounced. The fog here. Hmm. Whoa. Which one? Yeah, abundance, harvest. He comes with intent. He comes with ill intent. You know, maybe it's some sort of event that's coming on and he was invited to this. But the whole reason why he was going, anyway, you know, after the party's gone, so to speak, I believe it started with the father, the husband, then the mother, and the children, because they saw something. I think he left my ship. Wow. Wow. So that is what I have for you go for you guys. Um, very interesting. Again, Savannah, thank you so much. This was interesting. Um, if anyone out there um uh, wants to send me a short video clip like Savannah did, like uh Tierney 7 did, um, I'll gladly pull cards on it. This is what we're doing. Finding out some stuff. So, until the next time, folks, take care and off to the next adventure.